So stability is often a sought-after trait in aviation because it makes piloting easier and safer. The tendency to return to a neutral attitude after maneuvers and disturbances makes an aircraft more manageable, especially in poor weather. There are lots of ways of increasing stability along all the axes of control, but designing a wing to have a dihedral angle is one way of increasing stability along the roll axis. Naturally, this can be seen in a lot of civilian aircraft and airliners, like this Boeing 737, which has a dihedral angle of 6 degrees. But how does the dihedral actually increase stability? When an aircraft rolls in any particular direction, it will begin to slip in that direction because of an imbalance of forces. If an aircraft that is cruising with all of its forces balanced suddenly rolls in one direction, the lift vector will no longer cancel out the force of gravity. Not only does the lift vector not cancel out gravity, it also points off in the direction of the roll. Now there's a net force on the aircraft, and it will begin to accelerate or slip in the direction of that net force. For an aircraft with straight wings, it is my understanding that the side slip does not really have a strong effect. Neither wing begins to create more lift than the other. However, with a dihedral wing, the side slip will create a restoring torque on the aircraft. It's a little hard to visualize this in 3D, but the slip actually increases the angle of attack of the lower wing, therefore increasing its lift and pushing it up again. So to summarize, rolling the aircraft induces a slip, which causes the wings to produce different amounts of lift. This applies a net torque to the aircraft about its roll axis, restoring it to a wings level attitude. In this clip you can see the effect in action, as the glider slips back and forth but maintains roll stability. It's important to note that the wings create different amounts of lift only because of the slip condition. I've actually seen a variety of false explanations from prominent places including flight test. It's important to understand that without the side slip, no net torque develops. 